So we've got Umbraco up and running. So this is just the CMS bits. Now we need the e-commerce bits here. And to do that, we need to go to the e-commerce website and download the latest version of e-commerce and the Razer store. The easiest way to do it is to go to the products section here find the developer edition. Um, the developer edition has all the features of enterprise edition over here. So it's basically everything you need to try out the entire thing here. So let's just download that. Specify my email address here. And I already did like that. And go to the download page. Now, uh, first bit here is the e-commerce platform. That's the main package that you will have to install. Let's just download that into our Umbraco install folder here. Now, if we scroll down a little bit, you'll find the Razer store. We'll just click that, download the latest version into our install folder as well. So we got everything uh, nice and tidy. And now let's go back to the Umbraco uh, setup here. So let's set it up. Good. So to install a package in, uh, in, in Umbraco, we go to the developer section here. Go to the packages section. Install local package. Click the, I understand the security risks. Uh, find the file that we've got that we just downloaded. It's on my desktop here in the Umbraco install folder. Open it up, find e-commerce. Right, it's just load package. Uh, Umbraco is reading the manifest file of the, um, of the platform here. It's, there's some re uh, readme here, which will show you what changed. Um, just accept the license and install the package. What happens here is that the e-commerce installer is triggered it is uh, sort of figuring out all the steps it needs to take to get e-commerce up and running, installing configuration files, uh, merging databases, figuring out if it needs to upgrade any databases that are already there. And uh, let's just wait around while that completes. Good. So now we've got e-commerce uh, installed here. Let's just refresh uh, Umbraco and see that we got the application icon. Uh, and we did. So let's see if e-commerce is up and running. It'll just take a second to uh, to initialize here on the first run. And there is all the catalog stuff, the transaction foundation and all the, that good stuff.